Hello YouTube, uh, today I'll show you several ways you can play around uh, Nibiru and prank it by just having access to any combination of these uh, six cards right here. The only exception is Roxy does not combine well with Fanzies in hand, so if you have these two cards in hand you will not be able to combo. And most people see Roxy's as a uh, break going uh, going first or not a way that you can play to Butler But yeah, Roxy combines pretty well with all this other cards in the field right here and also any combination of this five this 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 you know <coughs> Can uh, lead you to play around Nibiru or even if you get Nibiru you end on Butler So yeah, I'll show the first one which is just uh, two kids in hand, you need two kids, there are uh, materials for Battle Butler <coughs> in this case, uh, let's say Lampsies and uh, Dropsies you want a normal summon, either or, it doesn't matter so the normal summon Dropsies, link away for Meow Dropsies effect, <coughs> and we playing only around the beer here <laughs> we done playing around uh, Ash Blossom on your first kid effect because you need extra cards in hand to do that so yeah uh, drops this effect you want to special the fancies the ones you don't have in your hand and you want to link the fancies off with the meow for your first doodle now here uh, you can stop because this is your fourth, fourth, fourth summon <laughs> yeah so you can just stop at the doodle effect and search for the pandemonium if you don't want to even commit to your fifth summon you just search for your pandemonium doodle activate doodle effect add your two two prank kits from your graveyard which are the ones you need to finalize the butler set the pandemonium and just pass and you have butler without even committing to your fifth summon but if you want to commit to your fifth summon then you want to go chain one, chain two. Uh, effect of fancies, you will send a pandemonium and special summon the fire. And Doodle will add you a prank. So here is your fifth summon. Most opponents will Nibiru here. So yeah, if they Nibiru, everything is good. You just, uh, yeah. You get a token from their Nibiru and you have everything you need in your graveyard and hand to go for the butler. So you link off the token of Nibiru for the Link Spider and then activate Pranks, Pranks effect, dump the fire. This is also in your graveyard, dump the fire and special summon a prankage token which is a level one so level one will go for the link Karibo link Karibo and uh, link spider for anaconda anaconda effect dump the thunder dragon fusion thunder dragon fusion uh, will shuffle back the materials you need for butler back to your deck and special summon butler also, you can shuffle three during your end phase, which one of them got to be Meow because uh, regardless of what you have a kid in your hand, even if the other three cards you have in the hand are interruptions or are not Pranky's card, you can next turn vanish the Thunder Dragon Fusion and add the Fancies. And by shuffling Meow back with uh, Pranks, you'll have place for next turn also if the Raigeki and three interruptions in your card was enough to uh, stop your opponent. But if they don't Nibiru you, let me rewind real quick. If they don't Nibiru you right there, so you had this, uh, the second fire special, then get rid of, uh, yeah, this was the field. And if they don't uh, Nibiru you here, then it's okay again. You go for your second doodle. Activate the fire effect, special summon one of these two. I have to go for the fancies. And if they Nibiru here, 
it's still okay. You can do the same uh, Link Spider, Link Revo, uh, Verte Anaconda, Butler. But if they don't, you just uh, activate the Doodle effect, targeting Pandemonium and whatever material you need to finish Butler. So in this case, Dropsies. And yeah, now you activate the Pranks. You set the pandemonium and pass. If the Nibiru here is even better because, uh, yeah, you'll end on a pandemonium as well if your butler get droplet or negated. <coughs> to go for your weather washer and, uh, let's say, live the other turn and continue on, uh, on your next turn. But yeah, if you Nibiru here, okay, lose the fancies, get the token token for link spider uh, pranks effect now with pranks effect you want to check your graveyard because you want to send the one material you don't have to make to finish butler so in this case I need a water in the graveyard to finish the three materials so I will dump the dropsies get a token link up token for link revo anaconda and this is in hand we also have three other cards in hand Anaconda effect, send the Thunder Dragon Fusion, shuffle back three materials for Butler, special summon of that Bell Butler, and yeah, proceed to end phase. As I said, you will, if you shuffle Meow and uh, uh, you have a Thunder Dragon Fusion in your graveyard, you are guaranteed to follow up for next turn. So all that you want to do, you want to shuffle Meow, Doodle, and even a prank kids, why not? So yeah, that's it for the first combo. And if they <coughs> don't appear you, you just have more follow up because you can trigger the kids effect also with the effect of pandemonium by fusion them. So yeah, now I'll showcase the combo or the hand when you have uh, when you have uh, Roxy's on the mix. So yep. Yeah. Okay, so with uh, Roxy's, uh, things change a little bit because uh, Roxy's do not combine well with Fancy's. So if you have this two in hand, you cannot play around the Bureau and and no Butler. So yeah, we'll just do Roxy's with any of uh, the other two kid. So yeah, we'll just Roxy's and Dropsy's. Okay, so we start by normal summon Roxy's. Uh, link off from Meow. Uh, Roxy's effect, banish one, draw one, and special summon. You always want to special summon fancies when you uh, open up with uh, dropsies. Then fancies and meow for the first doodle. We are utilizing three doodles with the Roxy's uh, combo. So yeah, uh, chain one, chain two. Fancies, you want to send the pandemonium and special summon whatever kid you don't have. So if you had fire, you special summon water, but if you have water, special summon fire. And also with the doodle effect, you want to get the pranks. And if they beer you here, you're good. You do the same Link Spider, Link Revo, Anaconda to Butler, and you draw one. Uh, then here you want to continue playing by Special another doodle, and with the fire effect, you want to special whatever you have in your hand. This time is dropsies. Uh, yeah, even if the bureau here, <laughs> the same will happen. Doesn't matter, but you cannot stop here because you also need to trigger the water effect <coughs> to go for your third doodle and special summon uh, one of these two. Let's say the fire one this time. Then, okay, in the bureau here, you do the same. If not, you activate the doodle effect, add the missing uh, pieces of the puzzle. So, this two. And your grave is looking like this. So, you have a Roxy, is fire, water. And yeah, three, three doodles. Still okay. You will draw one, you can shuffle them back with the pranks. No problem. And here, you activate. Set pandemonium and pass if they beer you is okay. Get a token, make it away from Link Rebo with pranks. 
you will need to be seeing your graveyard and see what you're missing. So you're missing a fancy, special summon token. You go for Link Rebo. This two for Anaconda. Anaconda effect. Send the Thug, uh, Thunder Dragon Fusion. Uh, shuffle three materials back. Special summon the Butler. And then end phase. You want to shuffle let's say two doodles and one meow so you have them for next turn and yeah that's how you play around the beer and prank it i hope this video helped you in some ways to better understand the uh, prank it and uh, really understand that you can play around the beer with uh, a lot of combination in this deck and if you have a good enough hand you can even play around the ash blossom on your first summon so yeah, I hope you liked the video, uh, leave a like and subscribe.